When you meet a Kumeyaay citizen, you are truly meeting a descendant of the first people of this area. The Kumeyaay have managed and lived in harmony with this beautiful land for 12,000 years. We know Maybe. that that time frame is even far greater than 12,000 years, yeah. but I'll use the scientific version. Yeah. This place is considered the first birthplace of California. Are the Kumeyaay proud of that? No. Yes, we are. We have always known of the beauty and abundance of this region. The very reasons that all who arrived here coveted the riches of this doing? land. He's an ass. It was the hands of the Mayor Kumeyaay who fed the settlers. It yeah, I got a shot blood, too. Sweat, and tears Community the shot. Kumeyaay people that built the Presidio. For the first time ever, the Kumeyaay people have been asked to participate yeah, in sharing from the sales story picture. of how yeah. the settlement of this area changed our lives forever. On June 18th, she's pretty good. I like her speech. She did a moment. They did a moment of silence. To the Native Americans of California. That signifies an enormous change from when the first governor paid a of California paid a bounty on the heads of all of California's Native Americans and predicted that our extermination was imminent. By the way, the bounty house was that right there at the bottom. Was wrong. It was there till 1910. $25 for a child that here, 50 for a man's here. Oh, yeah. She's talking about the bounty house, the first governor. Oh, yeah. So the bounty house was right there in Old Town. And I like how they call the Agari house an orphanage. Oh, no. After they killed them, they got the children and they sold the children into Europe as child slaves. So I have a friend, when I was a little boy, Abe Hansek, the statue of the Lord. Abe was my grandpa and Ella. We were sitting right there, and this woman said to me, she says, you're Ella and Abe's grandson, right? Yeah. We were sitting down there in the park, and there was the old professor who was giving a lecture. I was eight. And she said, when they killed my mom and dad, they lassoed me, put me in the Agrarian house, and they sold me, and I was a house and went up here on the hill my whole life. I'm like, me? Really? And my grandma was, you know, what's right there? And then the old professor came up and talked to my grandma, Ella Potter Hunson, which is my grandma. And she's like, I've been trying to find a way he to says, understand you know, the bounty house was there till 1910. He showed me right where it was at. It's right there where the Gary house is. And he's, he's the one that first told me, he says, $25 for a child here, 50 child. for a woman, and 100 for a man. This is in the 1860s and 70s. It was there for 45. And if citizens, he, and the governor sponsored it, the federal government sponsored it. And I remember telling my, I was a gas. You know, my mom worked at an Indian school in Brigham City and, uh, at the time in the Navajo. And like I, was, I was just telling Peter the story. I was a great distance runner, half miler, and we ran against the natives. And I was the county champion. I had the county record. Later, it will be on our this head. native kid daylighted me from here to the city, but further than that, beat me at the half mile. Couldn't believe it. And I'll never forget my coach. His name was Gary Reed. And he looked at the everyone. clock and he, I says, Oh my God, he says, words, look at the time. I says, that's the state high school record. And he says, well, they don't count. We hold these to be that all I'll never forget that. that. That they are endowed by their creator. Of course, their tribes are corrupt now too with the casino. You know, all the native tribes have gotten corrupt with their casino. And, I mean, it's just individuals raping their populace at all levels in this country. Today's oh, the mayor's mad at me. <laughs> God, he's a prick. Here on this land that represents so much pain and loss for our people. We do it with the hope sure of a new before. era. That's not a sweet. The new era I speak of is one where all the current residents and municipalities of the Kumeyaay homelands <laughs> not as open their hearts and minds yeah, and include us in the sovereign nations that we are. Yeah, those things are good. But I can't have grapefruit with the drug I'm on for my already bowel replacement, believe it or not. Of all things. No, I, I,
Like in Utah, uh, our uh, tribal leaders, it's the female that's the grocery. She's like that. She's a teenage boy. She tells it like the bearer of a massacre. She tells it like it was. Let's make no mistake. This is murder. Genocide. Today. What an important day. So, so, Gavin was invited. We know that. He didn't come. Mormon Church was invited. They didn't come. Which is outrageous. This is such an historic event. I mean, so what are they doing up there? Some kind of ceremony? Oh, they're, they're doing the smooch. I get this smooch. All right, nice. Got the cavalry hat on. Well, they got a flag. What's the flag? Yeah, it is sad. I don't worship the people that freaking. I guess it is what it is. I mean, the fact is, it is what it is. So when I got cancer, they come and smooch me big time. Yeah, a couple times. So I think it's important people to understand the flags. How come the Mexican flag is gone? Mexican flag. Oh, there it is. Right. There it is. So what are they going to raise Diego on this flag? City so flag is, is, is there a, no, that's that's, that's a, Spanish. No, that's San Diego City flag. It is. Yeah. I thought that was no. That's Spain. Is it Spain? Oh, that's oh, Spain. Must be Spain, yeah. Spain, Mexico. So it is Spain. Yeah. Spain. San Diego City flag. So is what was similar to that. The, so he was here. Cabrillo was here in. We know he was here in what? 15. 42. But this is the first structure of Father Sierra. And so, it was Mexico they called claim all the Westerners. And then it was, or, I mean Spain. Spain. And then it happened in 1821, I believe, when Mexico took it back over. And they declared the capital Monterey, California. And then, of course, the Mormons, my grandfather's statue right there, they, right over there, they come here, they go up there, they were there for the ceremony, and, you know, they invaded, raised the flag in Mexico, and the country freaked out, called Pope Number Invader, say they run against me, and they declared this the United States of America, America, that's cool, you need them to speak American. Pablo, English. Bravo, man, he spoke Italiano. Sabio Espanol? I've done a lot of good work with the natives today. I don't take off my, my hat for that flag. Oh no. Hell no. I'll take a knee every I'll time. Take, take it off eventually. I ain't taking. I don't like flags. I don't take a knee for any flag. I'm There's not a no flag waver. No reason patriotism anymore. Well, any flag waving. I don't believe in. I don't believe in lines. I mean, people are people. This line drawing, flag waving bullshit. We stand here in deep appreciation for all who have lost lives. Yeah. Values and try to uphold the best of our abilities. Values of family. Values of community. Culture. Our people owe us deep debt of gratitude to the hundreds of Kunyanis, soldiers of the United States military forces. Oh, so that's it's natives who joined the military.
and share our story with you. She's more of a temple right back there. That's not No, I know. When you walk over there and you look all the way, you can see it all the way to the way out. Off that corner over there. It's got to be pretty clear. Yeah. Probably not today. Maybe. I don't know what's clearing up. This is probably more. That's what it's supposed to be. Today, or the dead tide pools. So get some good Carl's bad. Uh, Desal water. <laughs> there you go. That's the number I use, 13,000. When I always got taught, who knows how long. This gift is for all the It's also been confirmed by the highest courts in America, a presidential decree, and by congressional affirmation. Today, as we love and pay tribute to our King Harry Warriors, and all Americans <coughs> who have fought and died for freedom. It's an honor to stand in and to raise our flag. The grand oh, they're going to raise their flag. The grand capitulation. Still. Like I said, how come? They're, they're speaking the, the language of empire. Yeah. This American white. I mean, white, brown, red. I mean, Europeans. They're European invaders. They were Spaniards. Ain't you a Spaniard? Do I tell you? Oh, you need, oh you've got to be one and not a uh, Trump's friend. You must be one of that Germans. Yeah. European invaders. Yeah, that's true. That's the Commerce Clause, right? Sacred place, huh? Gilded in gold, baptized in blood, right? Aho! Good speech. I like it. That's why it should be. That flag should be there. Has that flag been there before? No, because I shot a video in February and it was the three flag. So they must have put the. Is that a new. Did they put a new fourth pole there? Yeah. Well, that's, that's good. I mean, what a step in the right direction, right? Trump will probably have to come take down by have put Andrew Jackson statue in front of that. <laughs> Move auto. Oklahoma. The other trail of tears. Nice. So this is. Green oh, cool. New Deal? No, it's a new trail of tears. Yeah. It's called the Pacific Ocean. Yeah, right. <laughs> You'll see it tomorrow when I get out in the point. I uh, get out in the PB Point tide pools at sun up tomorrow morning. So this is cool. Yeah, yeah. Really cool. I'm glad we're here. You're the first to be proud of me. Yeah. You grew up right here on this freaking right around the corner, didn't you? We knew how bad it got. Wow. God, you remember how horrible it was? Needles everywhere. I mean, used to run around this hill right here all, as a kid, all over the, all the time. You know, I still love Old Town. I still like it down there a lot. Even though they... Well, this is cool.
I put it half mass? I should. For about 250 more years, right? Or maybe 13,000 years. 250,000 years until they're fucking uh, The blood heals? No, until, until most, most of the strontium is now. Oh, yeah. We got, we got sent off in the, oh yeah, I forgot, we got Fukushima. Whoops. Talk about genocide, right? Oh yeah, I got cancer. Woo! Uh -huh. <laughs> nice. Very exciting. Cool, huh? Really cool, because I shot a video in February and I talked about that I stood up on the hill and I shot the three flags. So, Spanish flag, 250 years ago, today. Mexican flag, 1821. American flag, 1848. The true people of this land's flag goes back up in 2019. Nice. Nice. So, let's get this right. So that was 1769 on this date. Woo! Nice. That's cool in hell. Thank you. Fantastic. By the way, Gavin was invited, didn't show up. There's Big Bill Walton. He's a real ass. And then, uh, but the mayor, he's mad at me. He won't talk to me anymore. Channel A, I tried to talk to Channel A, Dan 7. I was even nice, right? Well, we did talk to the girl from Channel 10. They don't like me. Yeah. But uh, the Mormon church was invited. I don't see any of them here. Oh, yeah, I'm here. I'm still Mormon boy. I'm Mormon boy. now like to call Erica Pinto, chairman of the Mormon Indian Village, to leave us with some really nice.